Twitter, check out my Polish Logical Report, including my books, consultations, and link to my academy where I'm teaching Charadasha course. And today I'm going to be uploading the video of career and wealth with some techniques regarding wealth. So I'm going to be showing that. So anyway, for Taurus ascendant people, Mars rules the seventh house, right? Of marriage, relationship, business, partnership, but a property meaning the gain of authority in life, meaning promotions. And it rules the twelfth house of foreign lands, expenses, okay, foreign earnings. Twelfth house represents hospitals as well, it represents meditation, all kinds of spiritual places. So it's now in the tenth house, the most visible house. 10th house is also the place where Mars gets its directional strength, meaning it finds its most vitality. It's ready to act. Okay, Mars in the 10th is ready to act and especially act in the right direction. This is why it's directional strength. It's not going in the wrong direction to act. It's going in the right direction to act. So one of the things that you will notice with this particular position is that especially in a person's life, marriage will bring about sudden rise in one's career and not only just rise in one's career you will see such person becomes an activist they try to do some kind of an activism as soon as they get married usually activism would be either related to children and it could be political activism okay because here as soon as you get married, Mars becomes active. Okay, and one of the things that you will notice, the activation of planets by a certain event versus a dasha is actually proves to be quite powerful. You know, like this is why they say that marriage can change your bhagya, can change your luck. Because hey, you can get married at a time that is not supposed to be bringing success but why does it do that because the other person's chart is now bringing this chemical reaction but also what happens is this is a person that takes a masculine approach in the marriage regardless of if it's a wife or husband they suddenly want to take control of how the marriage goes also one thing we see with this particular uh, placement is that a person will take on musical training whether they pursue it whether they like it or not you will see mother will put you into music now why mother is putting into music why because mars is influencing the fourth house so mother suddenly starts to get this vibration that hey i need to put my child in a musical uh, classes, musical training. See, there's a, the aspect, the way aspect works of planets, it's very interesting. Like for example, because of this Mars, with your birth, one of your parents, mother or father, suddenly their career starts rising. Because 4,000 I've noticed not only just represents the mother, it's also the father as well. It represents the caretaker within your family. So mother is not just the only caretaker, father also does the caretaking as well, right? Like me, like my kids are in the back playing and here I'm making a video. So, <laughs> hey girls, you gotta be back, back behind the camera. Go, 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 go. So yeah, see, I'm, I'm taking care of them really, really well. So that is something you will see with this Mars and also foreign opportunity will come in. You will go to foreign lands related to your work or works with multinational companies and you become in charge of a lot of people. Why? Mars aspects these fifth house of children and subordinates. But because it's in the 10th house of career, this is why we see the angle of subordinates coming in. This is actually the Mars that such people will make their children work at a very young age, meaning they will start making them do chores, cleaning things around the home, doing things around the home and giving them, you know, pocket money. They want to make their children professional with this position. Now, this is also the position of Mars that also brings about 
ability to attain multiple properties through marriage multiple properties through marriage and also you will see and I've seen this marriage also makes a person attain some kind of a physical combat training or if let's say you were a child with this position one of your parents started attaining some kind of a combat training but this is a very strong position this is a position of a person who wants to give themselves to society they want to do the work for society they want to somehow their work needs to be involved with society not just um you know any like, like some kind of a private uh place so anyway guys this is my analysis of uh, mars in the Ten Thousand aquarius if you're new to my channel subscribe below and if you want to know where um you can get all my courses and my books reports consultations or check out the links here astrologycares.com otherwise we'll see you later Bye bye